Catherine from Collier County Public Library, and I'd like to share with you a recipe from Hannah Queen's cookbook, Honey and Jam. It's a new recipe I tried. It's become my husband's favorite, but it's blackberry time cake with honey goat cheese frosting. If you love honey, I'm using um, Savannah Bee Company's Wildflower Honey in the recipe. If you love honey and you love blackberries or any type of berries, you'll absolutely love this recipe. But there are some special requirements for the recipe. You need two six inch cake pans. And so if you need to order those or buy those before you start, please do. And if you want the recipe to be extra special, order your favorite honey. For this recipe, you'll need blackberries, you'll need honey, you'll need, need thyme leaves, You'll need flour, baking soda, baking powder, salt, unsalted butter, granulated sugar, eggs, vanilla extract, and buttermilk. For the frosting, you'll need goat cheese, cream cheese, honey, and confectioner sugar. You'll mix together one teaspoon of the thyme leaves, a quarter cup of the honey, and three cups of the blackberries. I divided the batter evenly between the two pans and then I topped with the blueberry, thyme, and honey mixture. And I'm going to bake those in the oven. We will bake at 350 degrees for 30 minutes or until a toothpick inserted pulls out clean. For the frosting, you'll need cream cheese, goat cheese, honey, and powdered sugar. You'll cream together the cream cheese and the goat cheese. You'll add honey and follow up with powdered sugar. After stirring together the cream cheese, goat cheese, honey and powdered sugar for three to five minutes, it looks great. And I stuck a little taste and it tastes wonderful. The blackberry cakes will cool for 10 minutes in the cake pans that they cooked in, and then I'll turn them out to finish cooling on the wire rack. I frosted the first layer and topped with some of the blackberry mixture. I finished icing, you can smell the honey in the cream cheese and goat cheese icing, it smells wonderful, and then I topped with a few uh, blackberries and a little bit of time.